Welcome back. The soon to be Navy littoral combat ship, the USS Detroit, is about to be commissioned in a few weeks. And today, NBC 26 got a unique tour of where these combat ships are built. And uh, Ricardo joins us now with more from Marinette. It all starts with sheets of metal. The molding process takes more than two years to complete and results in a ship built for the U.S. Navy. In terms of uh, lethality is the term I'd like to use. Uh, this ship is, is well prepared to defend itself. The USS Detroit scheduled to launch from Finken Terry Marinette Marine in just a couple weeks. The littoral combat ship was envisioned to be able to go really close to the shore, uh, operate at very high speeds, shallow drafts, um, and in a focused mission manner. This is where they drive the ship, also known as the bridge, and these two consoles are much like an airplane. They mirror each other. In case one goes down, the other can drive the ship. This is the, the fastest ship in the Navy, and um, this ship, the USS Detroit, will soon be the newest ship in the Navy. The USS Detroit can run up to speeds of 40 miles an hour, and although that ship is set to launch in mid-October, exciting times are on the horizon for the shipbuilding community. The USS Marinette is scheduled to set sail in 2021, bringing in a strong sense of pride to the area. In Marinette, keeping you connected, Raquel Amell, NBC 26.